What's up, nerds and nerdettes and wee little nerdlings all? Your buddy Big Johnny G from Two Gun Pixie Presents Legendary Gaming is back again, folks! What am I doing here? Well, if you've already seen the thumbnail, then you already know! But for whatever reason, you didn't see it, or you just want to hear it from my lips personally, I'm here for another unboxing. Recently, me and Tommy V, we were at Lunacon 2017, and while we were there, we met some game designers from Shoot Again Games, and they showed us four games, two of which are going to be coming out in Kickstart soon, but the other two were already out. We liked the looks of them, so we got a couple of copies. First one I want to show you for this unboxing is Looting Atlantis. Atlantis is sinking, you're an Atlantean, and you want to grab as much cool stuff as you can and escape before you before everything goes down and you're forced to live in some little country where there's almost no advancement whatsoever and people are still cave dwellers. Looting Atlantis. So why don't we take a look and see what you get in the box. Yeah. All right, so I've been waiting to open this box for, uh, for several days now. And I'm uh, finally getting the chance, so I wanted a way to do it with you guys for this uh, unboxing. So let's take a look very carefully. Very carefully. Don't need to do much. And then get that out of the way. And let's see when you're going to pick up a copy of this game, what you, we don't need that, what you're going to get with this. All right, shoot again games. A game by Nick Sawyer. Looting Atlantis. All right. Yep, I'm having a hard problem with the box. That's not always the boxer's fault as much as my big fingers and lack of any good nails. But let's see. Here it comes. Sort of. Kind of. Uh, I got it. Don't worry. I got it. There you go, gang. There you go. Little bit at a time. All right. There we go. Put that aside. Rule book. Always on top. Let's see. Eh, quality rule book's not bad. I like the uh, the font, almost like a Greek style, since it's Atlantis. Eh, a picture of the setup. Now you may have already seen our convention attention that we did uh, with with Nick and his wife Diane from Shoot Again Games, and they uh, gave us a quick run through of how you play this. Look at the rule book is not that big. It's not that big at all. So you got one, two, three, four. You got like a, a total of like five, five written pages of rules. That means it's not a very deep and fidgety game, so that's cool. Now let's take a look at the board. Ah, oh, the board is nice. Now, if you did watch the video, then uh, then you realize that these here are lava flows, because during the game, you're going to get a chance to uh, manipulate the flow of lava and keep it away from uh, parts of the city that you want to that you want to be able to ransack. And uh, then you'll be able to leave to go to Egypt, or over here to China, or up here to uh, Mycenae. I'm having trouble reading that upside down. Greece, I believe. All right, so this is the board. Looks nice, nice finish to it. The colors really pop, that's for sure. And inside the box, I like the way they have it nice and handy here. This came out just because the way I was throwing the box around. But uh, everything fits in really nice. They did a pretty good job, I'd say, on the, on the inlay, on the tray. So you get these here. These are the lava flows. You're going to be using these, I believe they're wooden chips. We'll find out in a moment. All right, there you go. Yeah, you get these little wooden chips. Nothing special about them. They're just wooden chips. Then again, they they shouldn't necessarily be uh, anything uh, special or fancy about them, right? You're just going to use them to come down here. Woo, and the lava is going to flow down. And it's going to start burning stuff up. <laughs> Fire! Uh, all right, so that's what you got there with that. Move that off to the side. And you got some stands. Yeah. For the different players. So you can 
put these on and stand them up nice and easy. You got the different colors. Green, back, black, blue, and red, it looks like. So you're going to stand that up in this. There you go. And there's your little guy to go around city to city to city. And your little Atlantean crystal power jet car. So you got one for each. Now, uh, because I met them at the convention, they were kind enough to include these here, which don't come in the base set as far as I know, but to color match for each of them. Oh, it's green, not black. All right. Green, blue. Okay, well, there you go. So you get the different colors to, to match up what you have. Very cool. Oh, yeah, and then the black. See, I was right on the black. All right. And uh, the last thing you get is a big old stack of cards. You want to take a look? Let's take a look. Let's check out the quality of these cards that you're going to get when you buy the game. Let's see here. Be very careful. Don't need to cut my hand or wrist open. There we go. I know I'm always, always supposed to cut away from myself, and I didn't do it that time. Look at the Irish, I guess. I don't need that. Get that out of my way. Get that out of there, will you? Jeez. All right. The cards, first of all, the cards are, are nice and slick. They're not sticking together. There's there's no, uh, you know, sometimes you when you get the new deck of cards, they can sometimes kind of almost stick to each other a little bit. These are flowing very nicely. Very good job, I think, they did on the cards. see a random couple of looks on these personal force field and what we got here mass energy converter bum, bum, bum. all right i think the cards look good they feel good too they're a tad on the thin slot side uh, you might yeah you definitely are probably gonna want uh card sleeves for these i would say um i mean they're not flimsy uh, really, but they are just a little on the thin side. So just to be safe, you're gonna wanna you're gonna wanna probably uh, sleeve these. All right, but that never hurts to do anyway, even with cards that are that are uh, you know excellent uh, condition, very very uh, uh, thick, uh, dense cards. You still want to do that too. So I wouldn't call that a great big deal. And uh, and that's it. So the unboxing for looting Atlantis. It's a game by Nick Sawyer, 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 Sawyer. All right, so that was the board. Now let's come back up top. Hey, there we are. We're back up top. All right, nerds and nerdettes and we little nerdlings all. So that's what it looks like. I think that the game that you get looks pretty good. The board is sweet. The cards are okay. The chips, well, they're, they're chips. There's, there's nothing special to them at all. Um, and that's it. So... From Shoot Again Games, designed by Nick Sawyer, this is the unboxing for Looting Atlantis. I'm Big Johnny G. As always, I'm your buddy. I'm your man about town, and I'm done with this, so I am out of here.